Hello my dear followers. Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel, share our video, and turn on notifications to be the first to know about new videos. Welcome to our Blood Flower Trailer Review. Dylan and Baron experienced enlightenment from the aunt they met on the way. Let's see how long this will take. However, I invite those who say that Baron and Dylan will not get divorced to the like button. I think I'm not alone. Lovers don't leave, do they? Let's go to the trailer. As Baron and Dylan are returning home, their car breaks down. They enter the first cabin they find on the way. Of course, these huts are always empty. It is as if there was a two-step hut in Turkey. There's no such thing. This shed is sure to work. It will make them understand that they cannot be apart for a moment. They sit on the sofa. Baron immediately brings a blanket. He gives it to Dylan. However, Dylan Baron will also cover it. He tells her not to be cold either. Baron almost avoids making eye contact with Dylan. He doesn't want her to see how the prospect of her leaving bothers him. Karen brings the divorce papers to the mansion. Azade is very happy with this situation. The possibility of his predictions coming true was enough to make him happy. On the other hand, Serpil somehow reaches the cabin where Baron and Dylan are together. The way they look at each other and their attitudes are not lost on Serap. Baron is said to be in love with this girl. He realizes that he has no hope left. Firet, on the other hand, suffers from love. When Ghoul takes out the ring and hands it to Firet, she nearly collapses. You stuck a knife like that here, he says that I hurt myself without bleeding. The Rose is also tested with the same pain. She finds comfort in the arms of his mother. Fearing that Hassan might hurt both her and her mother, Ghoul renounces her love. Aren't Baron and Dylan so happy when they're alone? Don't you think they need to be alone? Comments are welcome to our crown. The food they eat together makes them smile. Baron should laugh. Dylan has a crumb in the corner of his mouth. Dylan asks why you're laughing. Baron says you're like a child, you messed it up. As Baron wipes the corner of his mouth, the looks are significant. Dylan hands Baron the apple that his aunt gave her after dinner. If you don't eat dessert after dinner, his blood sugar will drop. Baron is quite surprised that Dylan noticed this. Baron cuts the apple in half. Half says you, half says me. In marriage, not only lives are shared. As it awaits them at the mansion. The message arrives that overshadows Baron's happiness. The tribal leaders arrived in Istanbul. If he sees fit, tonight the subject of blood vengeance will be discussed. Dylan is full of fear. Furthermore, the issue of separation once again appeared before them like a wall. It won't be easy for Baron to hide his feelings from him either. When Baron gets home, Azaid gives the file containing the divorce papers to Baron. He says that you have the right to marry the person you love. However, Baron doesn't even want to deal with that file. He can't even bear to listen to Azade. Dylan is left alone with her feelings in the night room. She hesitates to even touch Baron's jacket. He says that there is an end to everything in this world. He thinks that everything has an end in all his sorrows and good days. He can share his valuable opinions with us in the comment section. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications to see more videos. See you in other videos. Take care of yourself. Bye-bye.